What's up guys, we are back with another Call of Duty Mobile video and guess what, we got the public beta test luckily. I think it is full now but anyway I will provide the link down on the description. So guys if you are new here, consider subscribing for more videos like this one as I will be updating regular videos on the test server. So stay tuned for that. So this is what I want to show you guys, the damage of Code 8 is very low compared with its stats in the official game. Also there is a new stat called the controls. So I just only opened the game and I didn't go much deeper so I can't talk much about that. Anyway the gunsmith is really amazing as you guys can see we completely maxed out the code rate and just look at the levels guys there are 45 levels that's crazy previously it was like maximum of 12 now it is 45 and the best part is that we don't have to upgrade each gun skins that is a well added addition by call of duty mobile. As you can see we have a customization mode called the gunsmith with lots of attachments we now can equip up to 5 attachments including the sides. We have different muscles including the different suppressors and compensators and each of them have its own pros and cons. So guys I am not going much deep into this as I will do that on a separate video. Also guys if you want to know anything about the public beta just comment down your thoughts on the comment section down below. Also guys we have many site options like we have different red dots, different holographics and different tactical scopes. Also even have the different laser sites also. So now I can proudly say this guys, as a diehard Call of Duty Mobile fan and also a Call of Duty fan in general, the Call of Duty Mobile has officially become a mini Modern Warfare 2. That's crazy guys, I will definitely do some attachment videos about the most requested guns and we even now have different crosshair options and my favorite one is the Rectical Type 34. But we are here to talk about the Coded Nerf guys. Coded is a weapon everyone is using the game. But with its stats showing here, I can say that the damage of the gun is very drastically reduced. I think it would be probably due to Call of Duty Mobile want to feel more realistic towards the real life weapons. But anyway, I will do as much videos as possible about the new changes coming to Call of Duty Mobile. So stay tuned for that guys. Also you can now equip different camo skins for the weapons. These tiger and reptile concepts look so dope. Also you can put some ornaments on your weapon which is basically some tokens and can equip your loadout with stickers in 4 different places. That is some next level customization. With this update, players of Cornwall will have their own unique set of weapons. That's something I really look forward. Also the starting of each game is now changed a bit with some cinematic effects and the game ID will be shown on below. Let's go for a game and also guys this is a public beta that is why we are seeing a lot of glitches we can't sometimes even select weapons and as you can see the mobility of the coded still feels the same and we are actually eliminating bots in the game so I can't really comment on how it feels in the actual ranked matches. Also guys that's some crazy thing happening here is sometimes you can't even eliminate Elmi. I don't know that is issue with the desync or not. Also guys you can now see the domination point will stay like that where we left off. That's sick guys. It is good and bad in some ways but anyway guys stay subscribed as I will be posting more videos on this test over and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video a thumbs up is always appreciated and I will talk to you in the next one. Up to then. Peace out.